Well, without a doubt, one of Tracy and the Big D's favourites coming up now, Christy Lamb. We're massive fans and massive supporters of this young lady. She's one of the hardest working singer-songwriters in country music. She looks amazing. And her latest film clip, Judgment Day, not only is a great song to listen to, but it is so lovely to see her back sitting behind a piano again as well. So, And she joins us now. Christy Lamb, congratulations on all the success and what a fantastic song. You must be stoked with the way that's been picked up by everyone. Oh, thank you. Thanks for having me. It's been really great. And I knew I was going to release Judgment Day for quite a while. And it's such a powerful, emotional song and quite raw that I wanted to do something simple but really powerful and impactful at the same time. So I wanted to get behind the piano for those who may not have got out to a gig of mine yet. Um, I don't get to bring out that side too often anyway because pianos are quite hard to cart around to a gig, as I'm sure you can imagine. So um, I don't get to show that side that often and that's kind of where I started with music was singing and playing piano and then I picked up guitar quite a few years later. So it was really nice to show that and uh, a simple, beautiful background and two beautiful dancers to portray that uh, relationship of, should I say, stay, should I go, that kind of push and pull of a relationship and um, until you make that decision on Judgment Day. It's been pretty special and everyone's really reacted to it so positively, all the shares and all the likes on Facebook. It, it was amazing. Oh, look, it's just mega classy. The whole the whole thing is just absolutely stunning Beautifully written, beautifully sung. The film clip's amazing. So congratulations. As far as I'm concerned, one of your best. Oh, thank you. I I was hoping for something special. We we always try and, you know, in our own heads as artists, try and keep topping the last thing that we did. And it's so hard because everyone's got their own opinion. Music's very subjective. But I... I was really happy with how it turned out and it is one of my favourites but it's also a very different side so it depends what mood I'm in but I, yeah, I was very happy with it. A treat video is just as important as the album, you know, if, you, if you're going to put out something it's, it's got to be different to what you can visualise yourself just listening to a song. It's got to be, whether it's dramatic um, with fire going off behind you for flamethrower or whether it's something more stripped back and a beautiful location and sunsets and lights and dress and it's it's all got to be part of the the package and add to the song it's the most important thing well the award seasons are just around the corner too for our country music artists where are we going to see christy lamb's name in the nominations and then the finals Oh, I don't know. Just fingers crossed that it will be in there. That's all I'm hoping for. I don't think there's any doubt about that, folks. Christy, what about uh, coming up towards the end of the year? We're well and truly approaching third quarter of the year. Then Tamworth (laughs) comes just around the corner. What's left in store for 2017 for Christy Lamb? I can't believe it. This year's just absolutely flown by, uh, releasing the album at the start of the year. Um, with the album launches, touring with Lee. I've actually just got back two weeks ago from America. I was over in Nashville for five weeks doing a whole lot of songwriting, getting a little head start on what could possibly be songs on the next album. Um, We've got to go through those and we'll be demoing up those songs and trialling them out at a few gigs here and there to try and gauge the reactions for next year's recording. But the rest of the year has got a lot of gigs. We announced the Loaded Tour um, two weeks ago when I got back from America as well. So we, we've just had the Gimpy Muster and the rest of the dates kick off from next weekend. Uh, we'll be starting and then we'll be heading into Victoria. And of course, straight after that, we'll be back in Queensland. So anyone who's got a pen with them, Friday the 6th, we'll be at Casino RSM. And then Saturday the 7th, we'll hit Queensland officially with Johnny Ringo's on the Saturday night. And then on the Sunday, the 8th of October, we'll be at Caloundra RSL. They're all free shows, so we'd love to see everybody there. And then, of course, we go back through New South Wales and finish out the year in New Zealand. So I'm really excited for that. I've never been to New Zealand and we're seeing in the new year with a a country music festival on New Year's Eve. So that's going to be an awesome way to bring in the new year. It's, It's pretty crazy how fast the year's gone. Well, we're looking forward to catching up with Christy Lamb when she comes on the loaded tour to South East Queensland. And, of course, you'll be able to check those dates on the Tracy and the Big D website. The single is called Judgment Day. If you haven't heard it, folks, you're about to listen to something special. And make sure you get a chance to have a look at this film clip. you see one of the most elegant young ladies in country music, mm. without a doubt. This is sitting at number six this week. It's called Judgment Day. Christy Lamb, it's been an absolute pleasure as usual. It's a-